Hello, hello, hello. We are at SeaWorld San Antonio and we are in a very long line waiting to park. Uh, but we are actually here today and it is opening up SeaWorld's concert series. So we are um, going to check out. This is the first day of Electric Ocean, first day of their concert series. And they have Everclear playing today. So that's that's what we're actually here to see is Everclear. They come on at 2.30 and at 7. So this is pretty cool. Every week during the summer, they have a um, a group that comes in. Next week, they have In Vogue, which is Tina's birthday. We're going to go we're gonna come see In Vogue because that's what she wants to do. So, uh, yeah. So we're trying to get in. But the traffic is really bad. And we're going to see what they say if I can get... I got up, up close parking because I'm a senior or season pass holder. We are now heading into the park. Very awesome. There is no mask, uh, no mask mandate indoors or outdoors as long as you are vaccinated. So everyone in our group is vaccinated. So we're going to be uh, able to not wear a mask. It's very warm out today. So we had to make sure we got our sun screen on. Um, and it's very packed here. So uh, Everclear is bringing them out, but we have a bunch of hungry ladies that we need to get fed and there's a french fry place i don't remember the name of it but that's the first place we're headed is the french fry place and you can see the this used to be the tent where they would uh, take your temperature and whatnot and it's all it's all open now no more no no more temperature checks then we got to hop over here and get darlene's i think we can do it to kiosk i think we need to get her annual pass. One of the cool things about uh, SeaWorld San Antonio is for teachers, they get a free annual pass. That's how they honor their teachers. So uh, that's kind of nice. So we got to get Darlene's because she is a teacher. So we tried to use one of the kiosk machines, but it told us to come over to the attendant. So that's what we're waiting for now. The line's pretty long there. We made it through uh, security, no issues. And you can see the big, beautiful SeaWorld fountain in full glory there. It is really busy today. Like, I haven't seen it this busy here in quite some time. But I do like it. It's, it's pretty awesome. No mask. It feels really easy to be out here today. And just looking at that fountain. Nice cool fountain. Looks good. A lot of people don't know that the uh, SeaWorld actually includes Aquatica and Discovery Point. And Discovery Point is totally free. You can literally get in there. No price. You can see dolphins. You can see uh, stingrays, things of that nature. Aquatica, of course, is the water park here and it's actually straight ahead. And then over here, SeaWorld with all the rides and stuff. So it's actually, it's kind of like three parks in one. So we have been waiting in the SeaWorld line to get Darlene's Pass for about 30 minutes now. We are chugging away here. And we are starving. We need some Spankies. Now we got to get in. We finally got her. Her card. She is official. <laughs> she is an official SeaWorld pass holder. Look at that. I did it. She did it. it. She gets concerts. Yeah. She gets Christmas festivals. She gets Hollow Scream. She's in. I'm in and all for zero point zero dollars. Dollars, yes. For teachers for free. Oh wow, this line is really small. Oh yeah. That is a positive. Already, y'all, we were able to get in relatively quickly, no problems at all walked right through um, there's no reservations needed we did make reservations but they didn't even check them so we can actually get in here with no problems at all so I came over here and grabbed a seat uh, in the shade you can see there's a lot of the picnic tables here are actually out in the Sun but I got one totally in the shade here but I'm gonna show you kind of what they have here so this place is called Spanky's it's really good they have buffalo chicken fries Tejas street fries loaded potato fries chili cheese fries and then they have a sago and truffle oil fries all of them they're, they're all delicious this is like my favorite place here here we go y'all dummy got the uh the baked potato loaded, baked loaded potato. fries um you can see they got some sour cream on there some bacon bits and some cheese uh, darlene and i we got the buffalo chicken uh fries yeah it's got uh it looks like it's got blue cheese on it ranch and ranch, carrots yeah and buff and popcorn chicken and then I should, I don't know. I think I should have gotten this one. This one has, she got the Tejas, Gabby got the Tejas fries. They got white queso, pulled pork, uh, looks like some tomatoes with kind of like a pico, avocado sauce, cream cheese, or not cream cheese, sour cream, 
That looks real good. Yeah, that does look good. Alrighty, so the the fries are delicious. Um, I would have liked a little more buffalo sauce on mine, and maybe a little more ranch dressing. You agree with that? I was gonna say the I was I, I, I know I, I just want more ranch. More ranch. More ranch for the fries at the bottom. Yeah. Um, I will say I think next time I'm gonna get Tejas fries. I think these are the winners for me. Oh, Tejas fries, Gabby won. Yep. Dami, you like it? You enjoying your baked potato fries? Are they good? You like that sour cream on them? Usually you don't like sour cream. For that one soft drink and those four uh, um, fries, four little tubs of fries, it costs thirty-four dollars, which is not too bad. And that was with the uh, pass holder discount, which is probably I think it's ten percent, twenty percent, ten percent or twenty percent. I don't remember what it is for food. Every place is different too. So, uh, but anyway, not too bad. And I'm pretty full now. Uh, we're gonna go head over towards the amphitheater where Everclear is going to be and see if we need to try to get in there and get a spot. We are heading over to the amphitheater and you can see they have all of the uh, electric ocean stuff out over the lake for tonight's show. And there are a lot of people here. You can see, not seen it this crowded. And look at that, they build a wall over there for the new water ride that's supposed to be coming in 2022. You can see that I don't know if that's the foundation or what, but I haven't seen that brick structure there. So that's pretty interesting. So here is part of the concert series. They have what? Oh, they have actually t-shirts. Everclear, look at that. That's pretty cool. And they, uh, is this a record? Yes, this is a vinyl. Oh, cool. That's really cool. Sparkle the Fade, World of Noise. That's really cool. So you can see here, uh, it's a first come, first serve basis, and we are 13 oh, yeah. minutes away from getting in. So it opens what? And you can see the amphitheater. Before? Yeah, it opens up 15 minutes before. You can see in there they are prepping. So it looks like uh, so you can, uh, the electric ocean. You can see on the walls there they have uh, the dates of all the different um, concerts they're having here. And you can see Everclear is Saturday, June the 5th, which is today, and then tomorrow night is the Little River Band uh, with June 6th. And then next week, right there in Vogue, we're gonna be hitting that one up too. They have so many, Vanilla Ice, um, and then uh, Jesse McCarthy. It's really nice. Yeah, they got, they, they're going all the way through July. Yep, yep. So we are one of the first ones in here. We have awesome seating. Yeah, that must be the, uh, yeah, that must be the good seating. So we are right in the middle here. Look at this, y'all. Alrighty, y'all, here we are. We're about 15 minutes from concert kickoff, and there's not a lot of people in here yet, but I bet you as we go along here, it'll get more uh, filled up. There's not a lot of, uh, um, I don't think a lot of people know about this yet. Uh, I didn't see a lot of signs throughout the, like, the sea world that it was happening, so. Maybe as the music starts, they'll get more uh, more people in here. But we got excellent seats. I mean, we are right up front. Um, they have an area up here where you can actually pay uh, $29. Uh, it's uh, reserve seating. And they got it kind of roped off there. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, we're right in the middle. If you can get here early, yeah, then you can get right in the middle. And it's, it's pretty uh, pretty cool. Pretty exciting. We're going to start with a song that's about family. I know all of us out of Texas are big on family. I used to live outside of Houston many years ago. And uh, I have a, two daughters and a wife for at home. And I'm uh, very proud of them both. Can't wait to get home tomorrow. But today I'm here for you and your family. All of us are. And this goes out to you. It's not a song about money. It's a song about love. It's called I Will Buy You a New Life.
Morning Girls. So what did you think about that? That was really good. I liked it, it. it was fun. I think if it weren't for those I two, more songs. yeah, if it weren't for those two little kids, I don't know if I think. What the, the those ones two dancing? Little kids right yeah, now they were tearing smashes. it up. Yeah. That was yeah, awesome though. Was, it was really great. Uh, Everclear brought back a lot of memories from the 90s, didn't it, girls? Uh, from oh, the yeah, 90s for y'all? Yeah, I was born. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two yeah. Years yeah. In the 90s. How about you, Dami? You were born in 2001. Did it bring oh, back any I memories? No. No, it did not. We got flamingos out here. You can see them. The reason why they are pink is because of shrimp. I did not know that. And you can feed them for 50 cents. Give them all the food they want. Would you, would you, would you fly out of here? You have every I mean, meal. Just, Look at those blue-billed ducks. Look how pretty they oh are. God, I'm telling you, they're fighting. Oh man, we got a fight going on here, y'all. <laughs> Uh, last time we came here, Stingray Market was not open, and now it is. But I don't see, Gabby wants a pickle, but I don't see a pickle. They have nachos, cotton candy, soft pretzels, churros, chips, novelty ice cream, and assorted drinks. But we're on hot pursuit of a pickle. The girls are going to ride the Sea Swinger, and then we're going to hit up Rescue, a Riptide Rescue. But sea swingers up first. And this is not one of my favorite rides. I get ill from this ride. So I'm gonna have to sit this one out. So we waited probably 10 or 15 minutes to get on the sea swinger and it just didn't happen. You can see, I don't know if you can tell those clouds over there, but they're really dark and they stopped all the rides. Even the uh, Texas Stingray has no one on it, but it's still running. So they're saying Texas Stingray is closed until further notice and they're not able to estimate how long it will be closed. So there you go. Alrighty, we're gonna step into Whitewater Exchange. I think Darlene is hunting for a lanyard. But we already have these cups. Oh, Gabby the might hats. have found a hat. She's been wanting a hat. The matching It actually hat. matches her hair. No, my water bottle. The water bottle. Or the water bottle, yes. And her hair. Blue. What? Oh, I mean, it looks good. You got it's got the the pink highlights in it. SeaWorld has all of their new gear out that I haven't seen before. Salt Life SeaWorld Medium. That's a pretty shirt. I like the blue. And that will run you. I don't know the price. This one is thirty dollars. So I'm assuming that's probably thirty dollars too. But I like that one. And I like this one, Salt Life. Kind of basic salt life on the back. Well, salt time. On salt time. Oh, cool. These look like they are new also for the little ones. $21.99. It's got the sharks, sharks on it. Seaward sharks. So we are hopping into chill out. This place has been closed forever. And it just opened up again. So we're going to hop in here. On a nice hot day, this place is awesome. Oh, no worries. Yeah, it's common. This is the SeaWorld Club. What? Yeah. Place to get crazy up in here. There it is, y'all. About people bouncing off the walls. Oh, that's some deep bass. Yeah, let's sit down. 
We're gonna try to wait whatever weather's out in here. But look how cool this is. Oh my god, the jellyfish! This is so new! Isn't that cool, the jellyfish up there? Stingray over there. So chill out has been closed since the pandemic began. And I think it opened up, I don't know if it was yesterday or the day before, but it's been open, it's just recently started opened up again. And this place is really nice in here when it's like 115 degrees outside. It's probably 65, 70 degrees in here, feels so good. Um, and then they got nice drinks, they got alcoholic drinks in here. I think they got like a pina colada. Uh, and then they got um, like Jack and Coke. So it's pretty cool. This is a pretty cool place to be. So, so, so Dummy got the last no, pina colada. I you guys. It's lit up. So Look how cool that is. It's a virgin pina colada. Yeah, it's virgin. We, yeah, we got that, Don Don. What'd you get, Gabby? The Neon Shark. Is that alcoholic? Yeah. What's it got in it? It was... Trinity? No, blue, uh, blue sea. Blue raspberry, raspberry something. Raspberry. So just oh, like or? Just like blue liqueur? I, I, I don't know. What did you get? I got the purple urchin. This one had grenadine and like raspberry and I don't even know. I, I There's so many ingredients. Oh. <laughs> Heck yeah, girls. Get it. Talk to me, baby. She looks like she would be fun to hang around with. She's now gonna be on my YouTube. This is so with my hair. <laughs> Look how cool this is. This is one big, huge light bright. You can put all your, there's all your light bright little sticks and you can stick them all on there. Look how cool that is. Maganita now has its own little building, it's been moved. I guess because it's very popular here. Mangonada. 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 But that's pretty cool. Well, we don't have, we're gonna go eat first and then we'll, we can come back and get some if we want some. These gators are jamming. So they built this city on rock and roll. But I don't know if they really like it because the question is, Gabby's question was, can they hear? So if you know if gators can hear, please put that in the comment section. So we are going to eat at Rosita's Cafe. It is the pizza and pasta buffet $15.99 plus tax so we are going to eat this what oh buffet last till seven it's a little messy in here i got some got some coffee stuff but she looks like they're just getting to it they're cleaning it up and then over there yeah i got it and then over there they are they got some booths over there we might have to get on one of the booths so we have a lot of chicken. We have a lot of pizza. Chicken, yeah. We got a lot of pizza. It's like some cheese pizzas. You get yourself a plate here. And then they have a big salad you can get. Salad buffet over here. All you can eat. Meatballs, pasta. Look at the pasta. Wow. We are in for some food. So the one comment we have about Rosita's is the pizza is like what you get at CC's. I mean, just get I mean, the, one, the new ones that come out. Honestly. Yeah, Gabby's, Gabby's trying to get the hot ones. Yeah. So, but it's it's like it's like uh, CC's to me. I don't know. Do you guys feel that way too? Um, it's like CC's. Well, pizza. CC's knows how to cut their pizza. But That's true. The, 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 the pizza is cut uneven. Which like, I, I don't know. Like struggling cutting it. Yeah, I guess like, it, it doesn't. Was rough. Yeah, I it guess. Was hard I that. guess it doesn't really make a difference because it goes down the same way. But it's just kind of, kind of an odd shaped pizza. But pizza. look at compare that size to that size. Yeah, I know they're 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 really different than the sizes. <laughs> so I actually got probably one piece. Well, I don't know. I don't know. It's cut weird. How about that? So they only had one dessert here. And well, it, there's another one, but oh, it wasn't out. And the apple. That's cheesy bread. Oh, she got cheesy bread. <laughs> That's her dessert. Cheesy dessert. bread and. 
chocolate. Chocolate pizza. Yeah. It looks like it's hell. Nutella. No. I don't know this exactly what it is. This looks worse than Nutella. Yeah. <laughs> but it's nice and warm. It is warm. Mm, Gabby. It's cinnamon -y. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Would you Sorry, eat it I'm again? Um, yeah, oh. So that chocolate is actually, it's like a pudding. It is pudding. It's not very sweet. Probably would be better with Nutella. But uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's too expensive. But that's pudding on top of a cinnamon piece of bread with a lot of grease on it. Yeah. So our meal was $55.39. The buffets were uh, $15.99 a piece. Uh, which equaled sixty three ninety six, but then because we're platinum twenty twenty one pass holders, we got twelve dollars off. So not too bad. It's just pizza. So the Bay of Play is back busy again. You see, they got the kids in there. They got all of the rides, all of the playgrounds, all of the water um, rides open. Pretty cool. I gotta be honest with you, it is insanely cool. Seeing all of the kids playing in the playgrounds, and the Bay of the Bay of Play here has some massive, massive playground area. I mean, kids are running all over the place. It's old school, like it's so nice to see. So glad the pandemic's winding down, hopefully, and these kids are all having fun again. Alrighty, we are back at the Sea Swinger. Girls gonna try it again. We're at the very back of line again. Hopefully, it doesn't look like there's any weather in the sky now. So hopefully they make it on there with no issues. the parade to come we are here two minutes after start time it's supposed to start at 7 30 7 32 you can see people are still getting in their spots but we have a lot of people here ready to watch the parade and look how cute that tree is with his googly eyes cute as could be
there you have it, y'all. What a fantastic day at SeaWorld. We, uh, we did a lot. We got to see the concert, the uh, Electric Ocean concert uh, with Everclear. We got to ride some rides, uh, most notably uh, Steel Eel, which is awesome. Abs just great fun. We ate at Spanky's. We did so much today. It felt really normal again, which was kind of kind of nice. Uh, you know, no mask. It was really nice out today. It wasn't too hot. I uh, cannot tell you how excited I am that things are seem to be getting back to normal. Um, so anyway, what a, what a fantastic day. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you like it. Hit the subscribe button. Uh, we love you guys. Remember, live problem free. We'll see you next time. Bye.